on. I figured I'd give you an update on how we're doing on paying off the truck payment. So for the month of January, we managed to send them. Now my goal was to send them $1,042 a month so I could have the truck paid off in two years, which hopefully be paid off in 2023. So I had to send them $1,042. So I made in January one, two, I made three payments in January. So we're going to add those up to see if we met the $1,042 goal or if we were under or over. So we're going to go 770 plus 208 plus 100. We have managed to send them $1,078 in the month of January. So we did pretty good. We met our goal of $1,042 by, let's see, minus $1,042. We sent them an extra $36 on top of the $1,042 in January. So we did really good in January. I'm hoping February is to sit as good so far this month, but I already sent them a $600 payment for, uh, for February. Now this includes the truck payment, which was $416, and then an additional $184 to make it up to the $600 that we sent them. So we started this, he received the truck in January of 2020. This is my little book where I write down and all that and everything. We started with $31,000 is what we started with on January of 2020. And we are under 24,000 $100 is what we're at right now in 2021. So I do have money to send them for an additional truck payment of $66. Uh, you probably saw that video, um, the cash stuff in uh, video. So if you haven't, I'll link that in the cards at the end of the video. But $24,100. Now all of this is with the interest and everything added in. And we just, they just gave me an amount of, okay, this is what you need to pay. And this is what the interest is included in with those payments or, you know, all that and everything. So when I was talking to the person on the phone, um, the interest and all that is included in with the payments that I'm making each month. So it came out to when you add all of that up, because... We took the truck out for, I believe it was six or seven years or something like that. I don't remember. I think it was seven years. But we're going to have it paid off way before that. Um, they took the amount that I was paying for the truck and he times that by how many months that it would be for the um, to pay the truck off. And then that's how they, I guess, figure out the interest or whatever. I, I really don't know. I just took the number that she gave me and told me, okay, this is what you still owe. So I said, okay, fine. So this is how I started off for January. We started off in January with $25,778. And we have it $24,100. So in the month... Let me see, 25,778 minus 24,000. Oh, I got to do it again. I hit the wrong button. 25,778 minus 24,100 equals $1,678 is what we've paid so far to date. Which is not bad because we paid $1,078 in January and then the $600 payment we just sent them last week. So I have an additional $66 that I have to send them this week. So this will even be even less than that. But this is what we still owe on the truck for um, 
$24,100 is what we still owe on the truck from $31,000. So hopefully I can get it paid off in 2023. I'm pushing to try to get it paid off a little bit sooner than that. But if not, 2023 is my goal to have the truck completely paid off. But I figured I'd just give you a quick update on how we're doing on the truck payment. So you can see that we're right on track of what we want to do as far as sending them per month. And we even sent them a little extra last month, so I'm hoping I can do the same this month. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. If you have a YouTube channel, link it down below. I will go and subscribe. I love supporting people. If you go out, please stay safe. Stay healthy. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.